Hey guys, it's Nikki. I just wanted to share a tag I just finished with you all. This is going to a friend of mine. And it's a little late, but better late than never, I guess. Um, so I just wanted to go over what I'd done to create this. And I started the base of this card as cut from um, some manila uh, cardstock. And I covered it with this paper. And it's by uh, American Traditional Designs and I got this guy several years ago and I've just had it in my stash it's called Holiday Cheer Earth Tones and it's it's very subtle um, I just wanted a small pattern on the background so I adhered that to the manila cardstock and I cut this tag shape out on my Cricut and I used the cartridge um a child's year and the tag I used is on page 40 and it's right here and I cut it out at 5 inches it's, it's a pretty big tag but uh it, it's taking the place of a card so I cut it out and then I adhered some of this trim let me see if I can get close this trim right here um, all around the edges I just went around the whole thing with that trim before I did that I distressed the edges with um, vintage photo distress ink and then I put this down and after that then I took some of these um, <coughs> leaves that I found in the floral department at Hobby Lobby, I think I got these at, and I just uh, cut the stems off and adhered the leaves down, and then I took these flowers, I have a video up where I made these flowers um, a couple of weeks ago, and so I adhered these flowers down, and um, just took the, let's see where, um, right here. I just took the stems off the leaves and curled them and stuck them in several places. And I have one of my homemade stick pins and I stuck it in there. These little flowers right here and right here, they're not really flowers, but they're just kind of floral shape. That's from a K and Company die cut pack. I don't remember the name of it. Um, it was just one in my stash. The gold um, floral, uh, not floral, flourishes um, here, here. I got a little one right there. There's one at the top. This is a um, this is a die cut pack I got from Michaels. And it's the Kane Company. And I just used this biggest one right here. And I just cut it up into pieces and adhered it down. And it doesn't it doesn't have a name that I see. There's oh, glitter swirls and frames is the name of this die cut pack. So I used that and I just um added these. And then after that, I have some of these um, chipboard letters that I got in a, um, just a big bundle at Hobby Lobby. And I think there was like 10 different colors. Anyway, they have them, <coughs> they had those in red. And I just um, punched out the word joy and I used my, I don't have any like real stickles, but this Studio G stickles from um, Michaels it works really well the glitter is really fine in it so I just um, covered my little chipboard letters with that and just to add some sparkle to them and I really like the way it looks so I just spelled out joy and then I put uh, my little precious moment image that I colored uh, with my Copics I popped it up on pop dots just to give it some dimension and then at the top I just had some of this gold ribbon um, there's I don't have much left but I had a, a good bit of it a couple yards and this actually came from my mom's sewing stash 
um, <laughs> I kind of took it, <laughs> but anyway, I just, I put that on the, um, the top instead of trim, I really liked it, so that's the front, and then on the back, oh, sorry, I'm, I'm dropping things tonight, on the back, I just adhered some red, um, playing card stock, and then I traced the bottom portion of this, um, this tag out on the same paper and I punched that border with this border punch it's by EK Success and um just, you know so it wouldn't be so plain and then I just took a manila uh, shipping tag and I stamped this image on it and it's uh, it's embossed with gold uh, embossed in powder and I used the image it's from Inka Dinka Doo holiday filigree and um it's just the christmas treat it's really pretty and um so yeah and then just on the back i just put some um, uh journal in line so i can just write a little uh, note to my friend and just stamped at the bottom um and it's just my little signature stamp so yeah that's my tag and um, it took me about an hour and a half, but I, st I was stopping and doing other things, so not too long. Anyway, just wanted to share that with y'all. Have a good day. Bye.